What's good? My name is One Spy, and welcome back to Silent Hill 2. Now, in the last episode, we got this vinyl record, and we also got the jukebox, bleh, jukebox button. So now we should be able to work this, hopefully. That goes up into there, and now we have the second button we can put back on there but we have to use two to c2 oh we need coins but the cash register is empty right right oh the texan cafes Marked on here as well. Right, so I guess we're going there. Oh, God. Hello. What was that about? There's a newspaper. In March of 1965, the town of Silent Hill was visited by the M Maine Physical Research Association. After a thorough examination, a team of expert dozers from the association concluded the area surrounding the now historic Wilts. We'll see. Coal mine to be highly active. They also expressed their hopes for further research and exploration of the gorge. These hopes, however, were never fulfilled due to the location being restricted as a histor historic nature preserve, as declared by Silent Hill Historical Society. Additionally, the idea was met with resistance from the local community, which claimed that the nature of the association's research would hinder tourist activity in the area questioning the credibility of our research and hiding behind the day trippers. Seems like an excuse to prevent us from seeing what's really out there, commented one of the researchers. Unfortunately, none of the local representatives were available to comment on the matter. Ed does note, at the time of publishing, there's no, there exists no evidence supporting the credibility of Radestias or providing effectiveness of dozing methods. Opinions expressed in the article do not reflect the author's view. Okay. Weird. So what they were trying to do, some mining activity in the mines here or something like that? And they didn't want them to or something like that? I don't know. Oh, damn. You gotta open that door, can you? You can. Right. Cash registers unopened. And we have one singular coin. Hey! Nah! You don't come in here and try to fight me! Nah! That's not how that works, I'm afraid to tell ya. Right, so now we can put the coin in here. And then it's C2. Yeah? Oh, that's the only one with a record in it anyway. Okay. Park on the lake. We spent the whole day there. Just the two of us staring at the water. So we've got to go to the lake? Well, shit's busted.
Oh. Is that the key for the door out back? It is. Well, let's save real quick. There is an auto save function as well, though, so I don't feel like this is actually necessary. I'm going to do it anyway, just for the safeness. Right, Nelly's bar key. What's the point in this? We've got to go up to the park there. Even if we go this way anyway, there's no... Okay, we can't go for that door. We can go up here. Bro's got them old man knees. Why are you... He came back after you left. It's fine. He didn't try anything. He just seemed sad. Mumbled something about getting out of town with someone. I wasn't going to let him drive in his condition, so I locked him out. His car should be out back. Maybe check if it's still there by morning. It's a greenish blue one, plate number ending with 06, I think. What did we just mark down? There's a question mark there. Am I gonna yoink his car? It should be out back here. This one, right? Yeah. Doesn't matter if we don't have the keys for it though, right? Hi. It's a cutscene. I just need to skip that because I thought it was an interact. Hi. Well, this is the ankle bite at first. Okay. Is there more? No, it's only the two of them. Oh, I'm going to die. No, I'm not. Ah, oh, because I'm just better. Oh, I'm so much better. Okay. Well, the fact that that happened meant... It's so windy. Wait, what did I get? Woodside apartment key. I thought I was getting a car key. Never mind, then. Something's... Definitely going on here now. Woodside apartment. Woodside apartment. It's straight up. I'm gonna presume we're gonna have a lot of enemies now, though. Might be able to dodge them, though. Because your boy needs some health. So it's probably better just to try and dodge him as much as possible. As long as no ankle biters, we should be fine. Is it this one? It's got to be this one, right? Yeah. Right, please tell me there's some sort of... Healthy. Okay, this is not cozy at all. Oh, so this go this goes right through to the park. God, the frames. Why are you doing this to me all of a sudden? Okay, that's better. Right, let's save because we're in a new area. And then. What are we looking for? What's this?
Three bright coins in the in the five hole. Okay, you don't want me to read that. Cool. Thanks. Right. Three bright coins in the five holes. Be first sits the maiden underneath the tree. The wind from behind the maiden. Doth blow a beautiful flare alone has to grow. And here comes the man so sleek and so fine in the pale moonlight his eyes doth shine. I've got no coins for this, so we gotta find the coins for that. Oh something to interact with. I don't need handgun ammo. I need health. In a lot of handgun ammo. Getting a lot of handgun ammo. Can I get like a flashlight or something, please? Okay, yeah, of course that's locked. We can go upstairs. Oh, Hello? great. Is anyone there? I know exactly what that is, bro. Come on, don't be stupid. Oh, there's mannequins and shit. There's a light. There's a light. What the? I don't have enough health to deal with you. I really do not have enough health to deal with you. Okay, actually, you're quite easy. These clothes. Please tell me there's a health. Something nearby. Shoot courtyard key. Please. Yes! Because we fought you, I've also still not got enough health to get rid of the red! Actual! Enemy designs in these are crazy though. They're so freakish. I love it. With all the handgun ammo I'm getting here, I can only presume I'm presume I'm getting a handgun any sometime soon. Never mind. That's the one. Probably shoot out of order. Please do not use until the problem is resolved. Okay. Let's to go through this window here. I hope we've got an enemy in here somewhere. Don't know where. Oh, it's just that. Go. Cool. Let's. Do a bit more search. I need to find. Oh. Locane siblings murder. Perpetrator commits suicide in custody. Walter Sullivan, the culprit in a recent homicide case, was found dead having taken his own life on the morning of the 22nd in his jail cell. According to the police statement, Sullivan's death was caused by blood loss resulting from sev severing his catroid artery with a soup spoon buried two inches in his neck. Ooh. Sullivan was apprehended on the 18th of this month on the account of brutal brutally murdering Billy and Miriam Locaine. Even though Walter Sullivan did not strike a former schoolmate from his hometown of Pleasant River as someone capable of murdering 
children. The schoolmate admits to having witnessed Sullivan in the state of severe paranoia shortly before his arrest. He was blurting, blurting out all sorts of strange look, stuff like, He's trying to kill me, he's trying to punish me, the monster, the red devil, forgive me, I did it, but it wasn't me, he recounts. I guess now that I think of it, he was kind of crazy, the schoolmate concludes. Oh, lush. Was this his apartment? No, surely not. Wouldn't make any sense, would it, really? Alright. Time to do a bit more adventuring, I guess. Oh, big and open. Whoa, shit in hell! They blend into the fucking background. Lovely. Ow. They can dodge as well. I hate that. Oh my god. That thing blended in perfectly. I didn't even know it was there till it moved. I do all that for some handgun ammo. Damn, I really got played there. I don't even need to come in here. Damn. That should be a crime. Not even giving me any health to regen after dealing with that as well. There's a key there. Surely you can reach that. Use your right hand. Why are you doing it from further away, you weirdo? <laughs> Oh, nah. I fucking hate kids so much, bro. Hey. Right, we got the key. Second floor hallway. Still got my bat out. So chances are there's something in here. Oh, some drawing. Huh. Quite the artist. Quite the dick as well. Need some more health though. Please deliver these to Mrs. Millie from 102. I'm really worried about her. She's been cooped up on all alone with his belongings for days on end. She won't even move them. And God forbid anyone else touch anything. It's breaking my heart just thinking about it. Oh. Huh. There's nothing here to bring to her. Oh, it's the basket. I'm presuming I'm not doing anything with that. Oh, there's another one! Oh, it's the frames! Okay. Fuck's sakes. I'm ever so grateful that you opened this up for me. But when I don't have the health to deal with it, it's kind of pointless. 
I think I'm gonna die soon. I think I'm gonna take on my first death. Surprised it didn't come any earlier, in all fairness. This is 102. <gasps> Syringe. Nope, it's a health drink. 201. Oh, we don't have the key for 201. Oh, the hallway is in that door. Never mind. Already dead. That's weird. I don't think I trust that one of those is already dead down here. Not that it matters because we've got another thing soon. There's my things going crazy. <gasps> oh, it's the fucking pyramid head. Wow, shit. Oh, well, I might have to turn my settings to low for that, because I don't want to get frame drops during Pyramid. Why did that sort of just like... Did like a VHS effect on that then? What was that about? I'll go through there. Due to ongoing renovation works, tenants are asked to keep out the third floor of the building. Okay, so we've got a lock on that door. Anything in here? Doesn't seem like it. Oh, the door's... Are open. I just walked past all them doors, assuming they were locked, because every single time I've had an open door so far, it's been open already. But a shopping cart. My handgun. Hell yes. I have to keep that one loaded. Yeah, what the fuck was that noise about? Okay, all those doors are locked. What's that noise? Oh, that's open now. Uh, open, that's on, sorry. The fuck? You weren't there, were you? Were you? I swear I checked that. Two twelve. Where's two twelve? Two twelve's just across from us. Oh, you're gone. Oh, that cannot be good for me. Well, that surely cannot be good. But Pyramid's gone. Oh, and now we're going over to that side where Pyramid was. Okay. Lush. Oh. Do I fight you normally or do I shoot you? I 
think I'm gonna fight you normally. These aren't that hard. The nurses are more irritating than that because they've got, you know, range and unranged. Career humble beginning. Seven. Sounds like it's a VHS. I know it's the fridge. I haven't got any health though either. I feel like I should save like my bullets for the nurses because they're a lot more annoying. Oh. Okay, that goes down. What's the point in that though? Like it all just comes back to here eventually. You haven't got anything for those two. And floor 3F is still... Untouchable, right? It's one of these again. Welcome home! I don't feel too welcome, funnily enough. Especially not with that thing at the front door. You know what, the most interesting thing, are these, were these people at one point? That's what really froze me here. I wish I just knew so much more backstory about this. Oi! Oh, okay, you got a hit. Fair enough. I'm good at handling those. It's the nurses, man. I'm really bad for the nurses. Not the nurse. Where have I got a nurse from? Whatever those are. The disemboweled bodies or whatever. Because of all the screenshots, man. Every single screenshot of this game is a nurse. Okay, there's literally nothing in here as well. So many empty rooms. More handgun ammo. You know what? For a place that's absolutely throwing so many enemies at me. For you. It's like a little happy cat. Oh. I'm getting the feeling that there's collectibles in this game. You must think I'm cruel, but this prison is of your own making. The choice was yours. I watch you make it over and over and over again. This time's not going to be any different, and I'll be watching here. And I'll be here watching. Hey? That's my first ball. Ball? That's my first... Coin. No items. Try to open locked doors 50 times. Well, I appreciate that. appreciate you telling me that I've actually just kept trying to open these locked doors 24-7 and they are just locked. Appreciate it. Yep. Love it. Thanks for the achievement. Love that. It's just, there's like... There's nothing for me. Oh. I haven't been in this room. The shoot. Hmm. One of the coins. I see. So that was kind of pointless, no?
that really hasn't done anything for me than just tell me that there is in fact a coin in the shoe. It says there's still nothing I can do with the shoe, so that's it just told me that there's a coin in the shoe and that's it. Right, well any other thing is one away, apparently I haven't touched on that. Right. It's another wardrobe. Okay. There's a dr Oh. The golden apple handle. Does this go to the wardrobe upstairs then? Okay, we might have a lead on what we're supposed to do here. It only took me about half an hour. Lush. That's taken me way too long. <laughs> I'm just going to say. I didn't realise I hadn't been in there. It's because I've been looking at the map. And the map only shows you doors you can go through. It doesn't show you rooms without doors that you've been into. <laughs> well, that's awkward. i got to remember how I get there. Oh, it's just right here. Lush. Right, golden apple. <laughs> oh, we can move it because we see this. Ah. Oh. Right where the rooftop pierces through the night left a homebound footprint with no owner in sight. But has he found a home? Oh please pray tell. Or a river of memories leading right to his this hell. Just need a key. There's like a nine box on there. Okay, so there's not a click on it. Just ramblings everywhere. Oh, okay. Right where the rooftops pierce, left homebound footprints. So right Unless that's not to do with that at all and I've just Right where the rooftop peers No that's so much easier, actually. Oh, you can only see it in the dark. I mean, in the light. The river flows. See, so it's seven. It's something seven eleven. Thirteen seven eleven. It's thirteen seven eleven. Yes! There's our first coin. And there's a key. 
There's a key just for this door. I feel like it's just going to be for this door. It's just those. I absolutely refuse to be killed by those things. 2F small staircase. <gasps> That's for that. Okay, so we've got the first coin. We've got another one of these. This unlocks, making a shortcut for us somewhere. To there. That's locked off, so we need to go all the way back. Oh, I know what I'm doing. I found just so much because of that. Oh, yes. Well, it's only a matter of time till Pyramid Head becomes a thing, though, as well, right? So there's always that. Hang on. There's something in here now. There is. Oh, that door's open now. What's that about? I've been hit by it and it didn't hit me. Right, well, we've got to heal now. So, there we go. That really does not do a lot of healing. I only just realised, actually. <laughs> you know what? This is going on ever so long. But now we know exactly what we're doing. And we've got this little staircase here. That leads us into... Three and also into this back area, which... Leads us to one... So with that being said, because this is like nearly an hour and a half long, I'm going to call this here. So with that all being said, see yous in the next video. See ya!